To be more sick of this letter of mine Intrusive thoughts that paralyze No fun is not It's never times There's got to be more Been here before Ooh, Life's better or sadder Got to break this pattern Floating away haven't done a balcony group in quite a while but hi guys it is the 24th the day after my birthday and this is such a special birthday to me i, don't, I literally keep saying that today the goal is to go to seven mile beach chill with the look of friends and i do want to go on to, into the pool before we go or should i come after i really want to look how tantalizing y'all can't tell me this don't look good what like be for real but yes Hansi, we are going to go look i'm still in my pajamas mind you it's 2 p.m <laughs> it's 2 p.m i'm still in pajamas i was eating some ox steel i'm gonna have to take that out the trash hair is literally let me sh let me show one of this trash this trash can is literally a bucket like what am i supposed to do with this like what am i supposed to do with that honey Nothing could fit, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw my trash out. There's like a huge trash can out there. Just gonna do that, and then I'm gonna get ready because it's two. My friends are coming off at work at five, and one thing about them, they don't play. As soon as they come off of work, they touch the road and coming over. So I will see you guys when I see you guys. Guys, we have made it to Seven Mile Beach. We're currently getting ourselves situated. Let me bring this chair, yeah. No, let me bring it. You want me to park? <laughs> no. <laughs> they love they acting like I can't carry things. Yeah The sun coming out though? Oh whoa. Oh there's another one first please make some choice Give me a size This can't be life if there's a point to lose a love we beat in pain It's all the same I hate this place stuck in this paradise Don't be <laughs> How you gonna just jump in there like that in the cool? It's cool, honey. Okay. Oh my God, this is freaking cool. Is what? No, girl, we're going to swim. I am, but Jesus Christ, me on. You want me to help? How are you gonna get me? Wait!
wet dog, but we are leaving now. It got dark, so that's how you know we've been here for too damn long, okay? That drive. 30 minutes, depending on how they ride. Aww, poor Leanne. They, they do it, they can do it in another corner. Tion, you're haunted. Yeah. Come and walk on the sidewalk. No, that should hurt my toe. Me too, girl. <laughs> I thought it would be better. <laughs> like, no, I could not walk on the sand. They over here there. walking on the pavement. We walking in the sand. My foot batama hot me. Well, we are heading to get jerk chicken and then we get in Foster's. Oh my God! If only I could bring jerk chicken back for Aisha. Aisha, one of my friends, she loves jerk chicken so much. Like I think she would die for jerk chicken. Yo, yeah. We getting some jerk chicken. This why I talk about this authentic something. The grill outside of the door. Hey, look how food. Yes, girl. See? Jerk chicken dip on grill, right? That's all. Can I get a jerk chicken with some festival? And I can get some. Um, yeah, that's all. Um, wait, can I have bread? I'll, I'll go with bread. Yeah. Actually, no. How much festival do we get though? Three. Three pieces? Yeah. Can we get extra? That's fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Extra? Yeah, two extra pieces. I think I need a drink. Great, a great soda please. Wait, how much was that? That's it. That's all? Okay, thank you. I was like, I want it to be perfect change. <laughs> thank you. Oh my god. The Ghanaians drink this. <laughs> oh my god, thank you. I appreciate it. Me, my drink? Thank you. Will you keep all of that underneath there? You keep all of that underneath there? Show your hair? Well, you can't wear a net. Who did your hair? She did a good job. She did a really good job. I'm gonna show you, okay? The chef said, show, show him. <laughs> he cooking it. You see all that jerk chicken? I will, I'm gonna bring some back to New York at this point. We'll do later. Love you, bye. Wow. Look for chicken. This is magic. Wait, this is a small? Bring yours closer. We need to move this envelope. Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Leon busting out in the car. You know what, She's not waiting on though? nobody. Okay. Y'all, I'm trying the jerk chicken. I haven't had jerk chicken in that damn decades because I don't trust everybody's jerk chicken and I'm not going to be eating jerk chicken like that unless it's grilled, home cooked. Ah, uh, them something dear. All right. I look a mess. I look so chewed up right now, girl. It's okay. Um, <laughs> I haven't had jerk chicken in years. So, yeah. Let me try it. I'm going to dip it in ketchup. Because normally, back home, well, I'm home now. We eat this with bread. White bread. Um, I got festivals this time. Because, you know, I want to change it up a little bit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that is it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This is that good, good, good chicken. This is what I needed in my life. Oh my god, I miss home. Okay, I'm not coming back to New York. Bye. Heartbreak High. If you are not hip to this show, please watch it immediately. I love this show. I waited about like. I, I think I've, it's been like two years or so since they dropped the um, the last season and I was watching it. The new season dropped and I am eating this show up. Like the messiness, the entertainment, the way it's still like, it keeps you intrigued. If you're into like the funny, quirky, but still like messy, dramatic, drama feel shows, get on Heartbreak High immediately. It's on Netflix. Pacific. That shit was good. You swallow before me chew. You swallow the chicken before me chew it. That was really good. <laughs> I'm gonna go get ready for bed. And I will see y'all when I see y'all. Hi guys. 
it's a new day and it is my last full day in the Cayman Islands so I am heading to go and meet my friends for some lunch because they're working but they're still trying to make time and then I'm basically gonna just walk around like the the town area but I am ready the outfit is eating Ruben if I can show you I don't even know where to put you out but let me show you the outfit okay see and these are can y'all use one I could go back really far though but Oh, give me one minute. Bye, bye. Okay, I love Alicia. The first person you guys met who actually like walked us um throughout the whole place, gave us a little tour and like helped us in. I love her. She has the same birthday as me. I'm pretty sure I caught that in the vlog. Like, what the heck? I love her. <laughs> no, it's too windy. I'm going inside. I wanted to do a balcony brief, but ciao. The sun hot like Pippa. But yeah. So we're gonna see our friends. Basically, I'm I'm gonna be burning up. Like yesterday, I got so black. Like I took off my I took off my bathing suit. I was literally white and black. <laughs> I was like, hold on. I was literally pale in some areas and dark on the others. So I am currently just gonna head out. Um, Alicia got my taxi for me, so we're gonna you know meet them in like nine minutes i think y'all this birthday has been so special like i have not gotten into this but on april 4th i nearly died i lost control of my car and everything coming from like new york city i was not supposed to drive i actually had train tickets to go to new york city but i ended up driving because so which is so weird i ended up missing both trains like which is so that's not something that's usual for me i'm very punctual when it comes to like making sure I, like i'm on time for things except when it comes to like leisure activities like going on well except for like when i'm getting ready for you know dinner that time on my birthday but you know what i'm saying i missed two trains and i just ended up driving to new york city to see aaron ray yep <laughs> and coming back from the concert the weather was bad throughout the whole day it was raining storming and stuff like that but i still drove on my way back it was raining snow and hailing like all at once all at once just set out i'm like five or six minutes in after leaving from the rest stop and i lose control of my car like my rear wheels started coming towards the front of my car and apparently it's called something i i got the name of what it was called i don't know if it was called oversteering or something like that but I literally like did that like five or six times and all I could do was plead on God like while the situation was happening. I was literally like trying to turn and I don't know how to explain but try to manage the wheel in order to like regain control of my car but I lost traction in my rear wheels and it was literally like it was a near death experience for me and it also was like an awakening call for me. Like I've been even prior to that I've been like you know trying to build my relationship with God and being more closer to God and stuff like that. But child, it was literally so scary. The last few seconds that I thought was gonna be the last seconds that I ever have. Um, the first thing that came to my mom was my relationship with my mom. Stuff like that, like, it just makes you see things very differently. It makes you like think of all the small things that you've bickered about or like quarreled about is literally minute, is literally, is minute, is minuscule, is, it does not matter, it's not of importance, like let go of that weight, talk to the people that you've had issues with, talk to the people that you love, make sure you're checking up on the people that you love, like I don't know how to explain but it, it was just an awakening call, um, I literally cried the remaining two hours that I had on the on road, um, I held that steering wheel so tight I did not let go to do nothing, like and I had two hours worth of a drive left, I, w I went home and my hand, my palms were literally red. Like after that incident, like losing control of my car, I literally lost control of my car near a truck, like a whole truck. And I literally left unscathed, uninjured. Y'all can't tell me God is not real. Y'all can't tell me God is not real. Like he be doing his big one. The devil be working overtime, but he need to put in his PTO. Because when I say God, God really got me out that situation because I don't know how I survived that. I literally don't know how I survived that, but it's all thanks to God. And I'm here. I'm 23. I made it to 23. Like, I'm doing my big one. I'm back home. I'm with the people I love. I'm surrounding myself with love. I'm checking on my friends. I'm checking on my family. I'm being with family. Like, 
that's what's important to me right now. Um, I been, I don't even do like dinners like that quite often for my birthday, but this past dinner was literally amazing. Like having so much genuine connections and genuine friends and family, it's it's an amazing thing. And when you think of people who like don't even have at least one person to like come to or talk to to confide in, like for me to be able to have multiple, it's a blessing and I'm truly grateful. So I want to make sure that I'm keep myself within my people, talk to my people, because at the end of the day, those are my people, and I want to make sure I'm there for them just as much as they're there for me. So let's go <laughs> and spend some time with some friends. <laughs> Activities for true. Dinosaurs is actually crazy. Look on him. He gonna pluck something out of the chickens followed us. And they got their little minion over there. Loki plot and they trained that one well. How do we tell the difference between chicken hen and rooster? Because one of them the one with the um thing on his head? Yeah. There's one with some like a, a mohawk. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you can do lay away. Here it is, lay away. What that is? Yeah. Oh, oh, you're talking about lay. Like we call it financing. Same thing. Yeah. Like a payment plan. Yeah, these look good though. They look good. Mm -hmm. 
The music. Why? The music sounds good. Oh, do you guys have a She's She wanna spend money in a. <laughs> back to work i'm gonna stay in town and wait till they come off because they come off in literally like two hours so that's enough time for me to like do a lot of stuff here in town while they come off because i don't want to just go home wait for them and then they're gonna come over and they're gonna come over anyway because we're having a cool day so you feel me it just works that i'm staying here but i'm gonna go ahead and find me something to drink first because you know i'm feeling nice Guys, they have a Game of Thrones collection. This is crazy. <gasps> this is so crazy. Literally a white walker right here. If you could see. Then I think this is Aya. I don't know if this I don't know if that's ghost. I mean he does have red eyes. Yeah, ghost, he does have red eyes. And I wanna know which dragon this might be. Yeah. Sorry. No, you're totally fine. Go for it. Go okay. Go Hi guys, welcome to Pandora K. Hi. Hi. Hi Gigi. Bye. She was born for this. She's a vlogger, guys. You're a vlogger. How cute Silversky is. Like, this is so cute. Like, this is so cute. What is this unnecessary planet doing just sitting in the middle of the waterfront? Like, what? And to make matters worse, there's just like a, a octopus just sitting. Is that an octopus or a jellyfish? Either or. <laughs> I want a mango. I always want me some mango something. They play the good music, y'all. Like, hello? Yo, if Leanne ever has a suggestions and recommendations, because I asked her, I didn't even ask, I said I'm gonna look for a juice bar. Sis already got a whole paragraph. Sis got a whole paragraph already of recommendations. Like, I love Sis. I love her. <laughs> Y'all. Well, cheers. Hello. 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 All right, let's taste her. Audacity for them to be playing this song. I can't finish this. Like it has mango banana rum is what she just told me, and I'm like, I'm not a drinker. Like, I don't know, drinking is hard. Like, especially when it tastes like alcohol. If it didn't taste like alcohol, y'all, I swear there's a shark right in front of me. There's something swimming in this water. Listen, I guess it's she. Let me see. So I you about to clip my ass. Wow, this is perfect. You're so fine. Thank you so much. Wow, this is good. For him. Look at my face! Look at my face! Look at my face! This is my sister! 
This is my auntie. You already know Auntie Charmaine. Yeah, yeah, I already know Auntie Charmaine. <laughs> Say hi. Doing my um, toes. Wait, go towards the sun. Hot girl. Y'all, this my twin. Tell them we were born in the same year. In the 70s? No. The ones who do it best? Um, she's so out of order. <laughs> she... <laughs> this is why I can't deal with. Kidding, we're heading to the pool. I lied. Why are you laughing? Okay, I'm coming now. I'm sorry. I'm coming. Yeah, we head into the pool for a late night dip. We literally, me and my sister just stopped talking. Like, we've been talking for like four hours. So we are heading to the pool. Well, finally, I know they tied on my ass, but hello. We here for Tiana even said fuck on her because where is she? I wonder, I should put up my hair now, but I mean, that's even more. What? It ready for me. Oh, oh, Leon ready look on her. Yeah, the hot tub right there. No, sir. <laughs> it is so warm. You're gonna blow dry your ass tonight. I'm gonna see if I catch it. Y'all need to get in here. Y'all need to try this. I love it. Thank you. Y'all need Thank to try you. this. You're welcome. Y'all need to try this. What's this that? shit is nice. It's <laughs> <laughs> like Gina. <laughs> Let me pretend I know why you're doing it. My water looks good, my boy. I'm telling you, Pat. I want to see. You missed it? I was supposed to. Hello? No move, no way. I used to, but I would drown every time. My hair get wet. You see? The two look I don't know how to swim, Simon. Guys, we are at the pool, honey. Oh. Hold the case. The case? Yes. You, oh, you found it? Yeah. Let's put it in there. Me and Leanne are swimming. These guys are losers. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Where to my mother? Where to, where to my mother? You hearing the my heart, my heart. Somebody call me their liver. Girl, Couple I days. <laughs> I don't be listening to them, but they irritate me. No, literally. Okay. Bye, honey. I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Girl, I, don't love, I love watching Me, really? Yeah. <laughs> Could you put on? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you lost? How you get yeah, lost? Hi. Lost. How you lost? We lost. We Where we you go? Around, and then we come around. I told you. We, you reach, have... we reach all the way down the coast, you left. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? You know your hockey highs are not good in <laughs> So, guys. This is my auntie. Wait, I'm not going to go. Wait, what you say? She laughed. I'm not going into the pool. <laughs> I look like wet dog, but they leave it me. Oh my god. Guys, I am actually coming. Girl, don't. You better make sure. Come Let me hurry. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. I'm literally leaving tomorrow and they're leaving me. Yeah, wow. <laughs> you it's crazy. Now we're gonna link up again. Now we have to. Bye, Bye guys. Bye. My friends love you all. Now I'm just, I'm here, but at least I'm here with my auntie and my sister. Oh, don't play. I'm home. Right. Yeah, what happened? Right. No, not me looking dry out and like wet dog. <laughs> Pardon. I'm gonna eat my remainder, the remainder of my jerk chicken. And then I'm gonna hop in that shower and get ready for bed because, oh yeah, yeah, thank God. Oh, uh, because your girl got a flight tomorrow, okay? We gotta go back home. We gotta go to the home far away from this home, okay? So I'll see you guys tomorrow. That's why you keep a nigga keeping me, I swear.
This is yours. Oh! I, I'm not taking you. that in the airport, but you have been amazing, wonderful, so nice, and your hospitality, your welcome, like the way you welcome me here has been amazing. Thank so I just so want to leave you with something. Happy related birthday. I know I didn't, birthday, I didn't get to see you, but I was like, I have to give Alicia something. So there you go. Thank you so much. Good morning, guys. The time has come. Where <laughs> you got to say goodbye. Oh my God, I cannot believe. My birthday went that well. What? It's time to go back home. The outside looks so beautiful. And this is the first time I've seen someone that people. What was that way? I was there. Anyway, um, hi guys. Good morning. I cleaned up the apartment a little bit. It wasn't too bad. This lace is atrocious. Like, please. It's okay. The tan line is about to be vicious. But either way, I'm leaving to the airport now. Tammy, she about to come grab me. I love Tammy. She's really nice. She's even trying to see how I can get some oxtail, but I don't have time. I'm going to miss this flight. <laughs> well, God forbid. But this was such a wholesome birthday trip. I enjoyed myself so much, and I actually can't believe I'm back home in six years. Like, wow. I'm so happy I got to see my friends, see my family, spend time with everyone. And shout out to my friends for, like, making time for me every day after work. Wow. Like... They really pulled through and I appreciate them 100%. But I'm so happy. I'm 23, guys, and I got to see my sisters yesterday, my aunt. All I can say is I'm so grateful for this experience. I'm so blessed to be here to see another year, open up a new chapter. Let me take this off to show y'all. I'm sorry. But this is such an amazing feeling. I feel fulfilled. I feel like i feel content so i'm just happy that i came and i'm trying to speak quiet but through without it but i'm just so happy that i came here for my 23rd birthday because it was a last minute trip and i was like you know fuck it let's just go back home my first birthday trip ever i've never traveled for my birthday which is kind of surprising but i just don't want disappointments and when i can say this trip exceeded my expectations i will definitely try to be traveling on my birthday more and i want to make it I want to make sure they're wholesome experiences, fulfilling, and joyful. So this is my birthday trip, and I'm glad you guys got to come back home with me. I didn't get to see my actual house, my mom's house in Bottetown, but that'll, that time will come. I'm going to head back to New York, and I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Okay, I'm just doing my last walkthrough. Did I ever tell you guys this was a hamper? Like, it's magnetic and everything. Okay, open this. And then it just, what? Definitely been using it because it's cute. And every time you walk past this seat, it turns on. So there's two of them. And I guess it's called the frame. So this one, look. You see how it's off? As soon as you walk past it, it turns on. Which is very trippy. <laughs> Again. <laughs> We're heading to Atlanta together again. <laughs>